Hello everyone, I hope that you are doing well. In this video, we are going to learn how to configure and run MPTCP version 0.96, the newest MPTCP, uh, which was uh, released recently. Uh, this configuration and this MPTCP uh, can help us to run MPTCP on a higher Linux kernel, uh, on the Linux kernel 5.0. Four. If you want to do this process and run MPTCP version 0.96, you should go to the repository. Uh, there isn't a Debian package over there. You should uh, download the repository. Then you, sh you need to uh, create the package. So it means that you should run make menu config. Uh, configure the config, uh, the configs, uh, enable MPTCP, enable schedulers, and uh, do the configuration, uh, which it takes some time and it's a little complicated. For because of that, uh, I I have the Debian package created for you. So the only thing is that you should go to my github repository uh, github repository which the link is in the description download the files and uh, run two comments to have mptcp version 0.96 in a higher kernel in kernel 5.4 so for this download these three files then uh, store them save them in a folder then run only these two commands sudo debian package dash i linux star deb then you should uh, wait some uh, moments When it is done, run this command sudo apt dash git install dash f. Uh, it is already installed in my computer. Then, if you run your name dash r, uh, you can see the kernel is 5.4, but you should notice that the mptcp name is not here, it is enabled. Uh, you can run sudo sys ctl if you, are, you want to be sure then mptcp enabled and it calls it to one okay then you can check i on am i using mptcp and you can see it is uh, enabled so in a nutshell to have the newest MPTCP and the newest scheduler such as ECF, you need to download the repository, make the Debian package, which is a little complicated process. But the only thing you need is to download the uh, files from my GitHub repository, and uh, you should run two commands, and you are all set.